and it's time to get uplifted, the bonus edition. So you know the names Neil Armstrong, Buzz Aldrin, John Glenn, but you should also know the name Peggy Whitson. She has spent more time in space than any other NASA astronaut. Whitson has spent 665 days, in fact, in space. That's nearly two years. She's made 10 spacewalks, which is also more than any other American astronaut. In 2008, Peggy Whitson became the first woman to command the International Space Station. And while she is in retirement, Whitson is making a comeback sometime later next year. She'll go back into space, but this time she'll do it with a private company. For Peggy Whitson, the opportunity is a dream come true. You know, of course, I dreamed of wanting to go, but you never know exactly how long that process is going to take. And so, you know, luckily I'm not dead and I'm going back. <laughs> It is in her blood. I was just going to say, yeah, it is in her DNA. I love that. Love it. And you know what? I really do want her name to become a household name, it too. It should. Yes. I really do. I mean, more time in space than anyone else? Absolutely should. Quite mm -hmm. a distinction. So. Peggy Whitson. All right. And uh, hopefully we cover all of it when she goes back in space. So I want to share things that uplift you as well. You can email us at getuplifted at WUSA9.com. Say it with me. Reach me on Instagram or Twitter on our Get Up DC social page. Pages.